The SmartCam HD Pro Web Viewer allows you to access live video feed of your registered camera or playback an event. The same functions are also available on the free SmartCam app. After logging in, choose the camera you wish to see live from the list on the left. Enter the camera password and click Apply. Now you can see the live video. Let's explore the other functions available on the web viewer. The second button on the bottom right is the mute button. This turns on and off the sound from the camera. Click once to turn off and once again to turn on. The next button of the camera allows you to capture an image from the video and is then saved in your PC's picture folder. By clicking on the manual recording button, it'll start recording to a micro SD card. If there is no micro SD card in the camera or if the card is full, a message will alert you of this. To reduce buffering from occurring, you can choose from three levels of resolution based on your network connection, low, mid, and high. Clicking on the gear icon on the left side will show you additional settings that allow you to change different functions and features of the camera. You can adjust the brightness of the video, raise or lower the volume on the microphone and speaker. Turning the night vision button on enables you to see in the dark by activating the IR LED to produce a black and white video. WDR is a function that alleviates the occurrence where people or objects are backlit due to the strong lights coming through the window. If there is a specific area within the camera's view that you want to receive alerts when motion is detected, the Motion Zone Select feature will allow you to designate up to three areas. Highlight the areas you want alerts for by dragging and creating a box with your mouse. Press OK when you are done. You can adjust the up, down, left and right directions of the video to fit the camera's location. You can review any motion or audio events that may occur by clicking on the Event Alarm tab. Select the day you want to review for any events. You can also narrow your search to either motion or audio. Click on the video you want to view. You can also go to the next recorded event by using the left and right arrows. The Playback tab gives you an option to play any recorded videos. Select the desired date and type. Scroll to the time you would like to review on the time bar and click Play. In the Setup tab, you can access various settings of the camera such as basic information, network, time, alarm notification, alarm schedule, and SD card. In the Basic Information section, you can review the camera's serial number, change the name of the camera, change the password, and check the current firmware version and if there's a new one available. New firmware will be notified with the N with the camera icon on the top right corner of the screen. Click this button to go to the Upgrade Firmware page where you can download the new firmware. In the Network tab, you can check the network settings of the camera. You can change the camera connection from wired to wireless by selecting Wireless Network, then Wireless On. Click Apply. Select your home network. Enter the password and click Apply, and then OK. After the network connection is complete, unplug the network cable, and if the camera's LED turns to green from blue, the settings are saved. For wired connections, connect the Ethernet cable to the camera and select the wired network. Enter the IP information and click Apply to the complete and wired connection. In the Time tab, you can change the camera's time, display time type, and daylight saving time usage. In the Alarm and Notification tab, the sensitivity to motion detection and audio detection can be changed. 
By linking the Picasa with a Google account, you can use Picasa to see the image taken when an event happens. You can also have push alerts via the web viewer and smartphone using the free SmartCam app. In the Alarm tab, you can set the alerts to only happen during the days and time set. Simply highlight the day and time you want the schedule for alerts. The SD Card tab gives you the option to change the use of the SD card. You can turn off the recording to the SD card, review how much memory is left on the card, or format the card and enable the camera to overwrite the previous video with new video. Now you could use all the features and settings of the SmartCam HD Pro on the web viewer easily and conveniently. Protect yourself and your family anytime, anywhere.